Are you looking for a game you're not going to rage quit or cry while playing? For example, Stardew Valley, the peaceful yet enjoyable role-playing and farming simulation game. It doesn't get any more peaceful than this. Many players who have put hundreds of hours of playtime in a Stardew Valley may be looking for something new. I'm Joey C from Game Rant. Let's dive into some Switch games to play if you love Stardew Valley, shall we? Let's go! If you love the open world and farming simulation aspects of Stardew Valley, you'll love Slime Rancher. The Switch version released back in 2021, and let me tell you, it really butters my bread. You play as Beatrix LeBeau, who moved to a planet called Far Far Range, and you gotta collect and raise adorable little guys known as slimes. Another cute little game you should consider checking out is Moonlighter. It's split between two mechanics store management, and combat. During the day, you're a shopkeeper, but that's not exciting enough because by night, you take on a series of dungeons. Fighting, looting, and taking care of the shop. Ah, it's an exciting life, man. Moving on to Story of Seasons, Friends of Mineral Town. It's a remake of the classic Harvest Moon, Friends of Mineral Town. If you're itching to farm in a video game, this is it, man. The original released back in 2003 on Game Boy, and this remake is similar to the Link's Awakening one. With all new updated graphics. Following? Good. Moving on. It seems the games with no overarching story or objectives are the ones people end up sinking the most time into. And Astro Nier is no different. It takes place on a randomly generated planet that players are free to explore, gather resources, and craft a gaggle of items. It's a fantastic game and lives in the same style of games as Stardew Valley. When thinking of games that one can relax with and enjoy growing something over time, few series come to mind faster than Animal Crossing. Animal Crossing New Horizon doesn't try to reinvent the wheel, keeping intact the core building, social, and management mechanics that players have always loved about the iconic franchise. My Time at Portia is another great alternative. Although the vibrant visuals and flourishing nature might suggest otherwise, My Time at Portia actually takes place in a post-apocalyptic world, many years after civilization was destroyed. Humans have since begun rebuilding society, a tall order that a player is tasked with continuing. The game's crafting mechanics is similar to other games in the genre, but my time at Portia stands out by featuring numerous dungeons that are filled with enemies for players to kill. And that's it. Switch games to play if you love Stardew Valley. We hope you enjoyed the video and consider checking out some of these fantastic games. See you later.